It's been reported that a woman accused of ringing Vanessa Feltz's former fiancé's phone up to 100 times a day has been arrested. According to The Sun, Ben Ofoedu has been receiving phone calls from an alleged stalker, who has also been posing outside of his home and taking pictures. A source close to the 50-year-old actor told the publication, she was harassing everyone he took a photo with on his Instagram, including his castmates on Tony and Tina's wedding and his close circle of friends. They also alleged that the unnamed woman would ring him up to 100 times a day and send him pictures of his new address. At the time, nobody knew where he lived. Furthermore, the Metropolitan Police have reportedly issued an update about the alleged arrest. Read more, EastEnders Nick Berry looks unrecognizable in rare appearance years after quitting acting A statement reads, on Wednesday 18th of January and Thursday 5th of February police received reports of malicious communication in relation to messages and comments posted on the social media platforms of a man and a woman. A 34-year-old woman has been arrested in connection with the investigation and bailed until a date in July. The investigation is ongoing, it concluded. The alleged arrest comes after Ofoedu was forced to contact the police earlier this year after they started targeting his followers. Vanessa, 61, ended her relationship with Ben earlier this year and hinted at his reported infidelities in a heartbreaking social media post. Don't miss. Gabby Logan fears being cancelled after Schofield scandal. Listen, Escape to the Chateau star Angel Strawbridge's furious leak trant in full, report, Kay Adams recalls chilling incident on the day of her mother's death. Listen, she wrote, my relationship with Ben is over after 16 years and I honestly didn't know what to say to you on Instagram. Elsewhere in the caption, she said, once the trust in a relationship is gone then you can't really get it back. In an interview with The Mirror, the Fats and Small singer reissued an apology to his ex-partner, and begged for her forgiveness. He said, I'm sorry for all the pain caused to Vanessa, to her family, to mine. We had an amazing 16 years. It wasn't perfect, but it was amazing. I truly love her. She's the love of my life. Vanessa is perfect? She didn't have any issues. I was all me, my insecurities. It's my fault, my stupidity, I've thrown away my life. I hit the self-destruct button. However, he then went on to claim that he realized that the presenter would never get married because she didn't want to have his surname. Someone not wanting to have your surname. I'm religious and the person you love most of all doesn't want to validate your love. That hurt, he stated. The only woman I really love won't walk down the aisle with me. And now it looks like she had every right to do that. I've really gone and messed that up. M50, it's a terrible age to make a mistake, Ben concluded. Following their split, the 50-year-old moved out of the London home they shared and has reportedly been living with a church friend in the city ever since.